seems I'm smelling jealousy right here because what sort of reassurance or what sort of thing is this? Sean is telling um Wani that she's a touch freak. I mean, she's she's touchy freak or she's what was like she likes to touch touch people. And he went ahead to say he knows it's not intentional. But then I said, ah, uh-huh. is jealousy coming in? What are we talking about? <laughs> Hey, he's jealous coming in. Meanwhile, today has been you can see um Sean after hugging and uh, Wani, he went and had to hug Handy. I said, Okay, you guys are triplet now. Hey, and that brings me to the gist of last night, you guys. I've not really talked to you guys about that last night. Um crying, crying babies with this twins. You know why I'm bringing it in here? Because of this thing Sean did. So well, before then, you're back on to spicy updates with lovely on. I hope you guys are doing okay. Do not forget to like the video. Stay fine. Be safe. So you guys, <laughs> hey, God have mercy. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not. You know, last night, um, the one of them got so emotional. You guys know how how it is with twins, okay? And what I really depicted from the whole thing was there is something that has been like honey has been bottling it up okay then with what one did uh during the winter tax now made her to like you know bring everything all out like she has been feeling lonely she has been feeling that okay my other twin has left me that detachment kind of you're not with someone you're very happy you're not more concerned about that person and you just left me all alone Oh my goodness. And before you knew what was happening, this young woman started crying. That is real cry. She was literally shedding tears. So when her sister walked into the room, it's like they had talked about it before she stepped out, you know, to go talk with Chinwe. When her sister came back to the room, she was just trying to like explain what she did to her, the way she snapped at her. Because I think there was a line she was supposed to kill her in. You know, when uh, Wani was telling um sean when sean was complaining like like the whole thing is overwhelming uh, victoria because of what she missed yesterday and all that so when wani was telling sean wani told sean that um the sister was supposed to kill her aim but it's like she forgot so because of that she was just the way she snapped at her the way she you know like hushed her there so i think handy felt embarrassed and with every other thing that has been happening, she came to the room. She was just crying, explaining to her. And you guys, you know, women with their monthly so surge of emotions. She was just crying. Before you know it, the other one followed her. But hmm, I have to tell you guys, I think Wani is more of a strong-hearted person than um Handy. Handy is more way more emotional because there was a clip sometime that um she was just asking her. Are you okay? You know, the way she just came, touched to her. Are you okay, are you fine? The way she just, ah, people started like, what? What's wrong with these two? Are they in love or something? No, that's the way with twins. Like, it's just like one person in two, you know? So then, you know, Handy was like, you're my best friend in here. You're the only person I have in here. You're this, you're that, you're the other one. So they were like, you know, stay talking. And she brought in the Sean situation that she herself is lonely. This, that. She spends most of the time with Sean. She said, oh, I'm here for you. I'm this. So um, Handy was like, okay, maybe it's a kind of payback because of it seemed Handy had a, a friend outside then that she was always together didn't really give her the attention the both of them still laughing they were laughing and crying at the same time so you know that whole thing sparked up a whole lot of reactions you get you guys know when we watch some of these things sometimes it's better you watch where you have chats conversations at least you hear what people are saying in the chat you might not really comment but you don't be listening to people's so some places were like ah maybe she likes sean too maybe she needs her own man maybe sean should date both of them i think that's the best but you guys i have to tell you that wani ah wani please oh, don't even touch her sean because even with that yesterday she was just everything she was saying she still you know that she was just coming the sister now, but you know that this one is gone. Wani is far gone. 
Finally, she was with Sean and even when the sister and Chingwe wanted to go meet Victoria upstairs, she was like, yeah, you guys should go and uh, like her own is, you guys should just go. Let me go have some time with Sean. You know? So I think now she is feeling this way because she feels is I'm just all alone. I need somebody to talk to. I need a man, la la la. So <laughs> people have been saying, please, or oh, they should get her one. In fact, they should one should Wandy should get somebody for herself so that at least she will not be feeling lonely each time her sister is with Sean. And I don't know if if she uh Wani has told Sean the whole situation, but I know she only told Sean about what happened during the wager. She didn't tell Sean about her sister feeling that she's um leaving her alone or she's lonely and all that she didn't mention that but today we could see that sean uh went after you know spending some time with wani he went to wandy and last night you know while i was watching because you guys hmm, it was a long night for me though and somebody said something in the conversation that uh, sean said it was honey he handy he wanted first like i don't know this one is allegedly i know he's one and you guys can see today now sean is saying he's actually observing he seems one he likes touching touching people and it's true because even while they were in the kitchen you know with the whole um tj situation and um what's this girl's name not uh what's um uh, ruthie with the whole situation and Ruthie, Ruthie wanted to make uh, rice and TJ was like, no, you make yam. So Ruthie was like angry that she made uh, yam yesterday. Why do they still expect her to make yam today to eat? That she wants to eat rice. She made it yesterday. And can't you see that um, Cassia is in the kitchen cooking in Domi? Why didn't you put stop her? So, but TJ was trying to like, ah, since they lost wager, let them conserve food and all that. So I don't know how Damilola came in, you know, and... They were talking about this communal food. The twins, ah, why he carried it on her head? No, communal, thing, communal food is not a thing in Biggie's house. That was the way she hushed Damilola. That was the way she did this Damilola. This, ah, I was like, oh my God. You know that Wani is, is hot. is quick tempered. So after that whole thing, uh, when she was like telling Damilola, oh, sorry, it's nothing. The way she just rubbed Danny's bum. <laughs> So it seems Sean has been observing these things. Maybe you're somebody that likes to touch people. That like to, you know, some persons are like that. They just want to like, you know, touch people, either it's your face or your head or rub your back, you know, anything. So Sean said he's observing. Now I said, okay, Sean, are you jealous or what? You want to cage this girl? You don't want her with anyone. But no, you guys. Uh, later I saw Handy with may may your eyes may your fresh whoa i really felt happy i said yes so this is the kind of company you need this is the kind of company you need at least you have somebody around you to talk to you so that you won't be feeling some type of way each time your sister is with <laughs> like this season the drama is 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 this is week one no oh. this is week one and drama is gradually coming up like the way these people the drama that happened in the kitchen today yeah, that one no be small thing. The drama was on another level. Like ah, everybody's beginning to show their 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 real self. Every everybody's beginning to come up and and you know how it is in Biggie's house when there is no food, when they lose their wager, there is no food. It's not like go get this one. In fact, this person, what's his name? Ben even hid a uh, fish. He was nearly that found it. <laughs> nearly that found that ben okay you actually he basically wanted to use it to so gary or do <laughs> you guys like we ain't seen nothing yet but whoa for the sean the one the handy they should just form a triangle the two two to one i think <laughs> that's the only way they can be fine well you guys that's that for that let me know what you guys feel do not forget to like share subscribe to the youtube channel so many gifs piling up i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.